Yeah. And is that done? Uh, yeah. Clock sucker there. Yeah. He's had a bitch about it. Yeah, he's had a bitch about it. Apparently, he wanted to work with me. He should have came up to me straight away and said it. You know, instead of fucking going, going, uh, going, having a cry to to Samuel about it. But Samuel doesn't like it. He can get fucked. I don't give a fuck. Really? Yeah. G'day, how's it going, Rail fans? Welcome aboard. Thank you very much for joining me. How are we all doing? Sorry about the delay. Uh, we had a we had a, real, a uh, update to Train Sim World for, for PC. Not sure what's going on there because uh, it was supposed to be one for PlayStation only, and uh, they were supposed to come later for console. Uh, let me have a look and see if. Uh, if anything's uh, come through on uh, their end. Uh, so, yeah, uh, Alex, uh, Dovetail Alex has actually said, Good morning, we've just uh, had a patch, uh, an update on to PlayStation 4 users. Our platforms will uh, will follow shortly. Uh, allowing players to use the uh, Class 101 D, uh, DMU from any installed DLC content that has this logo on the West Cornwall local. So, uh, we're not doing West Cornwall Local, but I'm just going to uh, see... Oh, yeah. 101's on there. Oh, wow. There you go. Uh, so, yeah, that's on there. Uh, all right. Uh, no, we're not doing that one. We are doing uh, Southeastern High Speed. That's what we're doing here tonight on this stream. This is the night night uh, night run, ladies and gentlemen. Night time uh, gameplay. We are doing night services with the four six five. That's what we're doing. So welcome aboard to this one, and we hope you enjoy the first one. This is a twenty hours oh nine service, and uh, actually we're going to do a little bit earlier than that. Uh, let's go with. Uh, we'll do this one, 20 hours. Twenty hours thirty-three. Alright. So it is uh just after midnight here in Australia and uh to let you guys know our live stream chat is open to subscribers only. Uh also um Yes, only accepting real people, not people that are going to stab you in the back, like some people I know. All right. Night run. AWS, traction control, and eyes fly, and out of me. This is the uh, new LOD4 lighting system. This is the only route that currently has it. By the way, this is a sound mod, uh, 465, and, uh, it is, uh, on the community page. I'm not sure if this is Rob S as well. Let me just, uh, double check that. It's up on the, uh, Train Sim community mods page. Uh, 
It's Itzya165. Itzya165 with the Class 465 sound mod. The Class 465 is back in stereo. Get a load of these fresh recordings now for Train Sim World 3. These sounds were recorded at the crack of dawn from a 466 between Ashford and St. Mary Cray and, and a Class 466 and 465-9 at West Morley. Uh, yeah, Morley. Okay. Uh, so we have people saying huge thanks for all the sound mods. Uh, sounds even better now, thank you. Uh, didn't think it would be possible to outdo a great Armstrong powerhouse, but yet here we are. Wow. So some great compliments about this particular sound mod. And this is sound modded, uh, first time I'm checking it out. The bell's all the same on that. our first night run and uh, we're starting off in the early evening at uh, currently 20 hours 37 uh, with the train not in real life though it's after midnight <laughs> next stop Northley Yeah, I have to say, I'm, I'm looking and playing this sound mod at the moment, it's, I don't know, I'm not really liking it, to be honest. I 
I don't hear any sounds when it's slowing down, where the normal one you do. So that's a put that's a put off for me. I thought I'd give it a whirl anyway, but uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm not really liking it. Yeah, I don't like the fact that the uh, you can't hear any sounds when you're slowing down. I know the I know the original. You can so. Too easy.
Coming into the next station. You see, he, it just goes completely, like, sound just goes completely off. I just find that off putting. out later. Yeah. I just sort of been fighting with the uh, the aim the main dude on the SWR customs for tr the trucks. Uh, someone's someone's had a bitch on there and uh, yeah because I I blocked somebody on there tonight because uh, yeah, they're sort of getting under my skin, and I just the reason why I uh, blocked them, the particular person is because uh, it was just yeah, it just felt like it was the best thing to do instead of you know fighting because I'm the type of person that you know if I'm gonna you know they're gonna say they're gonna do something you know and then, and they're not doing it it's like you know you start questioning and then you know it turns into an argument at the end of the day because that's you know. That's just me, I don't, I'm a ballsy bloke, I don't take shit. But, uh, I thought, I thought I'll do the right thing and just block the bloke this time instead of just fighting, the, fighting over it. Because, yeah, no one gets hurt that way. <laughs> and then he's gone and had a bitch about it. So it proves that he's a bitch. So I don't have time for little bitches, little crybaby dobber fucking wankers. Little crybabies. Uh, crybabies can get f get fucked. I don't know if I have time for them little bitches. This is uh, the first time we're doing it with the sound mod. I'll probably say this will be the last time. I'm not really liking this sound mod, to be honest. So it's a big thumbs down for me. I'm not going to go and comment about it. I'm just, yeah, tell them how it is on here. Reckon someone reckons it was better than Armstrong Powerhouse, and that's why I thought I'll give it a whirl. <laughs> I have to say. Enough of beats sound mods on fucking from them, I'm telling you right now. They are awesome. So a big 
thumbs down for me for this sound mod. You can hear clearly hear the looping as well. If it was if if this was done by Rob S, I reckon it would be way better. What I'm going to do, folks, is um, I'm going to quickly pause the game. Uh, I'm going to quickly uh, jump off the game, take the uh, sound mod off, and then I'm going to come back onto the game. So there'll be a couple minute break. I'll stop the stream for a couple minutes and I'll come back. It'll be the same stream, but it'll just be on pause. So if you are watching, I'll just pause it for a couple of minutes, and uh, and I'll come back. I'm just gonna go and take off the uh, sound mod. This just doesn't sound right. I had a feeling it would be crap. I've used a bit of ETR stuff in the past and it's not that good. Cover photo from. <laughs> it's one of our cover photo shots. Okay, so we'll take a couple minute break after this trip and uh, we shall return. Alright, uh, there we go with that one and I'll go to the main menu and uh, quickly jump off the game. Uh, actually, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna quickly jump off the game for a second. All right, so just give me a second, folks, and I'll be with you for a second. Uh, and uh, oh, you can still talk to me. Live chat is open to subscribers only. Come and say good day. Love to hear from you. Uh, so I've got to quickly just jump out of. Uh, just quickly get on near it. Pardon me. Um, uh, Cobbin train symbol three window edited train symbol two prototype contact. DLC uh, 465 mod. I get rid of that. That's the one. Only one. Uh, while I'm off uh, for a second, I'll just get to quickly um, double check and see if that uh, other things come through. Uh, for the. No, it hasn't. Okay. Uh, sounds come through. Uh, uh, see, yeah, see, they, he did the 165 and all that as well, and they're not that good. Okay, so I did leave a comment. Sad to say, I gave it a run. Uh, don't like it. Uh, just uh, coming into uh, uh, just coming into stations uh, with no sound is a turn off for me. Uh, so yeah, that that's what was turning me off. All right, so let's go back in the game. Uh, I am running it as an administrator, so it'll come up uh, in a second. There we go. Bingo, bingo. All right, we'll rock and roll into the game again. We are doing Southeastern High Speed 465 action, folks, and it, we are doing the Night Run. The Night Run. This is what it's known as, the Night Run. 
and uh, what we call the night run here in Australia, here in Australia, when the trains stop running and the buses take over, the nut ride. <laughs> the nut ride. That's what it is. All right. <laughs> okay, so there has been a patch for the game. Uh, so 101s are back. Uh, are they back or are they they on the West Cornwall? That is going to be interesting. The 101s on there. I think they've actually returned. I don't think they were on there and then they went away for some reason. So I'm pretty sure I've done 101s on there before. Okay. The battling is split in that egg. I've just, like, it's just been sitting there all day. But it's just, yeah, been getting worse the last few hours. Okay, we're back on the game. Southeastern high speed night run and 465 action. And we are going to do another one now. And this is a 21 uh, hours 33. Uh, Gravesend to Dove. We did that before. We're going to do Dartford to Gravesend, 21 hours. Uh, let's do June. Clear, beautiful, lovely. Let's go. All right. I did want to ask you if you uh, know uh, where I can find uh, the flatbed trailer uh, with an update as I'm rolling the old 136 version still. Uh, hang on a second, folks. All right, uh, 2U24, London, Victoria, the Gravesend. We hope you enjoy this one. This is more uh, like, yeah, completely night. Let's get some white in here while we sort out this one. Um, I just have to get um, that sorted out because I, yeah. Didn't want to fight with him. Uh, ho hopefully he understands, you know, where I'm coming from with certain things as well. But, yeah. I just don't have time for... Yeah. I can do it myself anyway. I know how to do the uh, do the mod. It's quite simple. I've done them in the past, way before that. I did it. I'm just going to tell him he is copy... He is... Uh, it actually is a copyright mod. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna disable my camera. You guys can enjoy. Uh, no, that's not it. There we go. <laughs> Let's try to work out what one was what then.
Thanks for your patience, folks. Uh, we've got the uh, normal sound back on there now. That red lighting, ah, it's so beautiful. Love it. Meeting, meeting, meeting. Yes, I know. I am speed breaks up, speed breaks up, go. <laughs> Gaming chairman speaking. Hey Jason, how you going? Yeah, good mate, how are you? Uh, yeah, there's a patch that's just come through, yeah. Um, it's for the uh, 101, West, something about West Cornwall, something. Have you got, have you got that route? Yeah, 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 that's what it's for. Yeah, too easy. Always here for your service, bro. <laughs> they call me the they ain't call me the Godfather of train sim for nothing. Yeah, anyway, I'm on a live stream. I'll talk to you soon. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'll talk tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Choo choo Tuesdays tomorrow. Yeah, I'm hoping that, I'm hoping that the storms won't won't uh, yeah won't screw it over. Yeah. Yeah, well, I couldn't stream it last week because of that mega storm that we had. Yeah, I know. We don't want anything like that again. Yeah, that thing almost blew my roof off. <laughs> ah, true, true. Yeah. Um, yeah, there's a summit on, um... Sunday their time it'll be Monday morning our time yeah they're gonna show the they're gonna talk about the next couple months worth of stuff so yeah see Kansas got officially announced for tra uh, for American truck yeah yeah I will be around November December yeah 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 yeah, I'm actually getting the jetpack issue again on, on here at the moment. I've just seen a couple of them fly in the air. I <laughs> know, oh, it's been creep, creeping back in the game slowly. Uh, that's why I said to you, they never squashed it. Yeah, yeah they never will. Alright. Alright. Alright, well, I'm by. Nah, cars, I don't know. Alright, so yeah. Huh? Yeah, yeah, well, that's what I said to... I said that to uh, Jesse earlier. Yeah, yeah, well, that's what. Yeah, well, I don't know, I'll have to find out. Yeah. Alright, alright. Alright, cuz. Alright, see ya. Uh, as far as I'm aware, yeah. 
Yeah, well, I'm still hearing off the grapevine that the River Games one's been pushed down and the the Boston Sprinter update's been pushed up with the new train. Oh, apparently it's next month. Yeah, well, that's why I'm hearing off the grapevine. Who do you think? Yeah. Next stop is Gravesend, folks. watching the stream tonight, g'day William, hello to you, railway guy if you're watching, g'day to you, CSX GEET 44 AC, he's changed his name to uh, something else now, but Mr. CSX, g'day to you buddy, came to say g'day, you know, well, perhaps I'm going to stream earlier, say g'day again, all the other rail fans out there, Fanning is uh, on as well. There you go. See, I missed. I, I, I did see. I said to you guys that I would have missed one of my regulars. There you go. There you go. Changed your logo there. What um, M tracks is that? That looks like the. Um, that looks like the uh, blue design. Is that the 50th anniversary one? Does look like it. Does look like it. Might move up a bit more actually. They might uh, give us the light. The Amtrak 1908, there you go, uh, 108, 1908 or 108, 
108. <laughs> if I'm just going with that. You made a mistake. It's a nice looking logo. Looking forward to the Boston Sprinter update. Uh, there is... Um, there is speculation that it is being moved up the the ranks to a earlier release than what it's supposed to be originally because uh, it is apparently penciled in for March. But uh, yeah, Birdie's telling me that it could be releasing in February and the River Games one's been delayed. And also, there is a sneaky suspicion that there is a stension coming for it. Okay, so that should give us the light now that it's gone through. Why isn't this giving us the light? This happened last time. Oh, oh no, it's giving us. Yeah, here we go. I'm hoping that's what the announcement is. Because, yeah, uh, a few people are, are sort of talking now that there is an extension coming. You got the Oakville subdivision, yep. Canadian Oakville subdivision. You um, probably probably uh, what console are you pl you playing on console? Or you on a PC? Because the reason I'm asking you is because uh, there the festival of rails starting this week and there's a big there's another sale. Oh. Pardon me, there's another sale coming up. <laughs> Pardon me, I just put it on that one. That's what happens when I scroll to get it. Power ring. Okay, I'm not sure if the PlayStation 4 is getting the uh, sale, but yeah, Festival of Rails this week. I know Steam's going to have the sale. I figured it's only PC Steam only that's getting the sale. Pretty sure the Festival of Rails is always a PC thing. The new route's uh, out on Tuesday, your time, for the new Glasgow one. Um, I could probably say to you, it's um, maybe maybe uh, better to hold off it a little bit. Uh, so some people are, you know, liking it, some people are not. It's got a few things that need sorting, but it's not as bad as a lot of people are saying yeah, it is. Coca-Cola machine, by the way, folks, we don't have any Pringles machines on there. And uh, there is the employee of the month, though, but the, the Pringles man loves to drink Coca-Cola. <laughs> so there you go. Two 24, London, Victoria. I prefer Pepsi. <laughs> the Gravesend. <coughs> well, at the moment, I actually prefer drinking uh, Powerade. I'm actually drinking a uh, Kiwi and Pineapple. There you go. Beautiful. Uh, that's our second run done and done. Shall bring one more. We're doing all night time services, folks. This is a night time uh, stream. Uh, so this is what we are doing. Uh, let's go now with, uh, uh, drive this service from, uh, Gravesend to Dartford. It's 20 hour, 23 hours 44. It's actually the final service of the trip. So let's do June. And thunderstorm in the night time. Thunderstorm in the night time. Don't like them because last Tuesday they blew out my live stream and I couldn't stream Tracy World. <laughs> but the funny thing is, the storm stopped like. 10 minutes before I had to go live with American Truck Simulator. So, 
It was like, yes, you can restream that, but unfortunately you can't do trains. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes things don't get not as you planned. Okay, let's get this on. Yeah, we had a mega storm. It was a hail storm. Tiny little pea-sized hail, but you know, oops. the lightning was just absolutely very, very full on. If you go to our Facebook page, there's a replay of the uh, live stream that we did. I did a live stream of the incredible non-stop lightning storm that was happening over the ocean but you could see it from my house out the front it was absolutely it was full on I had a I had a viewer on there too I Can I get under your umbrella? Can I get under your umbrella? I need a, I need a sound off the umbrella. Who's that? Can I stand under your umbrella? It's raining, dude. It is raining. <laughs> Start singing it. <laughs> uh, I was out of service. That's right. Why am I doing with the doors open? One of the negatives for the 385, uh, the new train that's been out, is that the rain doesn't hit the windows. It's not the first train on Trains in World to ever do that.
Oh yeah, so you got thunder, but where's the lightning? when you're doing a flyby, um, I, oh yeah, with the camera angle. Oh yes, yeah, so eight, that's correct. And uh, you hold down the shift button, and the arrow, and, uh, to go further ahead, and then... Run over by the train almost. Oh, there's a flash there, that was lightning. Yeah, flyby cam, yep. Yeah. yeah, F8. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, not F8, uh, it is just 8. I love this light, this red lighting. How cool is that? There's a couple spots with the red light on this new system. There's a dark alley uh, that has the red light down the side of the alley at night and in the, on this route now, and uh, near Gravesend, and ah, oh, so, so cool seeing it. I call that part the red light district. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just awesome. I like the colour. The lighting is, uh, yeah, way better now. Way, way better. Boston's getting this treatment soon with the uh, new light system. We're getting the new skybox and uh, lighting system. Big massive rims is getting an extension now. Uh, shift and arrow to uh, to do the uh, to go further down and that yeah. Yeah, you can do it for the keyboard on the PlayStation. I'll be honest with you, it's probably more difficult on console because you don't have a mouse on PlayStation 4. It would be easier on Xbox because you have the, the mouse capabilities for uh, Xbox. But yeah, it's quite difficult with the using the controller and then keyboard at the same time. 
<laughs> it's quite difficult. Cole's uh, southeastern fan. I think, I, if I remember rightly, I uh, answered that question to you on uh, a couple of days ago, but I'll, I'll say it again. It's uh, releasing tomorrow. So, Tuesday. Okay, uh, there we go with uh, that one. And a bronze. Get out of here. That's bullshit. <laughs> That's bullshit. Bullshit. <laughs> uh, I've already got a yellow envelope on this uh, stream, so yep, I'll get a review going. <laughs> It'll go green, don't worry. Um, that's it. Uh, our southeastern high speed uh, action has come to an end, and guess what, folks? That is the end of our Monday action here at Australia Worldwide Gaming. We bring to you four train sim world live streams today. Uh, two of them were the brand new Scott Rail route. I showcased the uh, brand new sound mod for the Class 385, which was done by Rob S. And very, very nicely done. Gave him a little bit of feedback as well. And uh, hopefully he takes that on board. And uh, there is a fantastic mod enhancement coming from uh, the London Midland, uh, Rob S. and the crew uh, this week or next week for the brand new... Uh, Glasgow Edinburgh route uh, so or Edinburgh Glasgow so yeah yes it is getting released uh, on Tuesday for PlayStation uh, there is a few issues but yeah um, depends yeah people are saying it's good some people are saying it's bad I already pinpointed the issues yeah that are there anyway uh, the sound mod has sort of bounced the sound out a bit uh, still a bit loud, just a tiny branching, uh, but yeah, uh, getting the PlayStation 4 set up, uh, yeah, we're about to uh, head off now, uh, that is our live stream done and done, uh, thank you very much for enjoying the free night trips here today, and, uh, we will bring you more action of Train Sim World tomorrow, Choo Choo Tuesdays is on tomorrow, our main event, ladies and gentlemen, we are live with Choo Choo Tuesdays, fingers crossed this week. <laughs> with everything we had planned for uh, last week has been moved to tomorrow. So we've got on the cards, Brennan Oldenburg with the DBBR 101. And we have, uh, in the inner city coaches, of course. And we have other great action on the cards. So join us from 8pm in Sydney, Canberra, Melbourne, Hobart, 7pm in Queensland, 7.30 p.m. South Australia, 6.30 p.m. in Northern Territory, 5 p.m. Western Australia and Perth, uh, and 10 p.m. in New Zealand, 9 a.m. UK, 10 a.m. Germany, 4 a.m. Boston, 2 a.m. in, Ida, uh, in uh, um, Utah, and Phoenix, Arizona, and 1 a.m. Los Angeles for our Choo Choo Tuesdays live stream here at Australia's home of Train Sim World Australia Worldwide Gaming. And don't forget, there will be a live stream poll vote going on our live stream of Choo Choo Tuesdays where you guys can vote between three routes for our midweek World of Trains community vote winner for this week, ladies and gentlemen. The midweek World of Trains community vote is where we have a live vote on the live chat where you can cast your vote for one of three routes. The winner will be selected as the, as the first run for our... Wednesday, Train Sim World 3 main event of our Wednesday tradition of Midweek World of Trains, which this week I do believe is episode 112, I think it is. <laughs> yes, because uh, I got it wrong last week. It's 112 this week, so yeah, there you go. Uh, so thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Have a great day. Bye-bye for now.
PlayStation players and other players of Train Sim World have received a downloadable update. A downloadable update is now available for your Train Sim World free experience.